So this sick new mod came out adding a completely new floor and I am gonna try and go get it. It is a variant of the downpour and draw so we have to go to alternate floors. It's basically its third variant and it's called the boiler and I'm gonna try my best. I don't think there's any way I could really force it. I kind of just have to go the downpour and, and hope I guess. We'll see if I can get it. Okay we got our treasure room. I'll take care of these flies real quick. I don't think I need anything too crazy. We are playing Kane, who is just uh, the GOAT character, to be honest with you. Oh, wow, that's really good. An X-Ray Goggle Start. I feel like this item is underrated. People start X-Ray and they just restart. They hit R. No, 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 no. Hitting uh, an X-Ray Goggle Start is kind of sick, in my opinion. The amount of value over time that you get with this item is crazy. I mean, I literally see all my secret rooms, dude. No, look. Which means all my bombs go towards maybe combat. Oh, Mr. Belly and a soul heart. Thank you. All right. So, uh, assumably, it's just an alternate to the downpour and I can just get it maybe? Oh, that's that's new. That's new. That looks like Burning Basement. But Okay, this is new. Okay, let's see. I think I got it. Whoa. Okay, new music? All right. What is that? Whoa! It looks like a uh, little ghosty goose. Obviously, the theme here is steamy boiler, which I love. That's sick. I think this dude has to have line of sight on you. No, he's just crazy. He's a madman. We're good. Soul heart achieved. So these little, I guess these are like little wisp things. They're kind of cute. They make the dip sound. It looks like they only go in lateral directions, northwest, southeast. They are pretty easy. They get hit. Uh, they die in two hits. Oh, no. They can go diagonal. Wow. This is why I say the things I say. Thanks, you X-ray goggles, for a free greed gullet. Anything in the curse room? No. Excuse me? Absurdly lucky run right now. Uh, unironically. <laughs> like, this is just a good run. What is that? Okay, it looks like they have red leeches. That guy looks similar to the dude that monster lungs shoots at you. Same thing? Yeah, same thing. It's just this variant for specifically the boiler. That's cool. Give me all that fool's gold because there was three in one. Absolutely worth it for all that money. This treasure room. Uh, I'll risk it on the blind. Wow, that was worth it. A good run. Satisfying tears right now, unironically. What is going on? <laughs> what else do we have? What do you do? What do you shoot out? What is that? What is this tear effect? It's like wavy. Interesting. Can I destroy the tears? It, no, no. Okay. They're very long lasting, high range tears that uh, last. Whoa, that go for a long time. They have the ambush enemies, just like Dross. Really high quality. What is that? What? Wait, that's sick. Can I turn it back on? No. Okay, so it's like a little puzzle. Turn off the valve and then uh, I can fight. Oh, and then it turns back on after I. I see. Look, look at this little area of effect. I can't touch this, otherwise I get hit. So turn off the valve. Kill the enemy. Perfect. Now I can go in here and finish off this dude. Why did I get planetarium chance? Okay, I looked it up. I think it's a bug that you get planetarium chance. I saw that in the bug fixes for the, the list of bugs on the Steam Workshop page, one of them is that the planetarium chance is too high. So, uh, and they said it's not fixable. So, <laughs> maybe th that's what's going on here. Because I definitely just went down and got 20% planetarium chance. Uh, I didn't get uh, anything here. That's okay. I was severely confused for a second, but that's okay. It's, it, 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 I'm having fun. I don't really care. But whatever. I was uh, a little taken aback by my planetarium chance just now. What is that? Pipeline. Alright, I'm gonna try my best to play well here, but also see what they do. It looks like four different segments. They all do something different. Coming out of the- Whoa! Cool! They come out of little vents. They all have their own health bars. Okay, that guy spews. I see, that one's like a conductor. Okay, pretty easy fight, actually. Unless they do something different when they get low HP. No, I definitely just destroyed one. Okay, watch out for that. Is it gonna, like, shoot brimstone or something? Cool fight. So that's uh, the first guy's the conductor. Oh, when you kill the conductor, you win! Oh, they just kind of run away. Oh, and if you kill them while they're running away, you get pickups. Nice. We'll take the HP. I have a ton of HP. I'll go with Devils. Oh! I would say that's worth it. All right, let's go to the next floor then. And let's say we got Dross. Okay, that's fine. Hey, listen. Uh, considering I had, what, like a 33% chance? Uh, logically, I guess, to get the floor? I'm happy that I even got it in general. Friend Finder. Uh, those are both active items, so he can't review that. So that was awesome. What a unique floor. Whoa! It affects their Dross, too! Wait a second. It affects Dross! You get the unique enemies in Dross as well. You don't just have to go to the boiler. That I like. That I really like. 
I love that. Maybe we can find some more dudes. Like, what are you? What are you? Probably don't stand in the direction where he's charging up, I imagine. This guy has a, like a pinwheel saw on his face. Oh, it's a it's a valve. And they one of those dudes run out ran out of his like time. His timer ran out, so he stopped. Balls. I'll do it. No problem. Roid Rage is good. He paid out. He gave me a two three spun really early on. Cool. I'm actually not even gonna pick up that red heart. I'll make use of adrenaline for the first time in my life and actually use the damage up it gives. Anything in here? I know I'm blind, but I got money, dude. Sure. Oh god, that wasn't worth it. Who in their right mind would spend a key to get rid of this room? This room's so easy. <laughs> what the heck? And a blood fight. Eh, blood's easy. Dude, this is a good run. Pure unadulterated damage and health. Uh, that's a two heart deal, so I gotta take it. Absolutely worth it. Let's go clear out the mirror dimension real quick. Uh oh, I didn't even see that leech. He's gonna start jumping. I, I think we'll be okay. Alright, nice. I am the lost, so I get this for free. Infested friend is nice for conjoined. And then we'll go. Dude, Ice Cube has no right being this good. Look at this. You get one Ice Cube and you're done for. One single enemy frozen in the room is all you need for a chain reaction to happen. Oh, wow, greed instantly died. Dude, my damage is really good. <laughs> Like, my tier rate and damage is absurd, and it's not even like a tier effect or anything crazy. It's just good stats. I love it. Ah, yes, the mega chess. How you doing? I don't have a roll, but I, I, I would still appreciate items. Let me see if I can get a roll. I, I highly doubt it, but you know, it's not impossible. And if not, I'll just take the hot bombs and jawbone, which are good items, especially if you have uh, no flight jawbone good. Hey, squeezy. I mean, binky. Hello? Oh, that was unavoidable damage. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, that was a tough dodge. I think I think there was a way there I could have maybe finagled it, but I just misplayed myself. Who do you get? Oh, the easiest boss in the caves you shouldn't have. Ow! Uh, that's super worth it. Let me see if I want to take this first. Oh! Okay, you know what? A knife run? I'll take a knife run, dude. I'll take a knife run. We'll take this, and then we'll take this, and then we'll probably live because I have dead cat. We're good. Knife run sounds sick. We are not even close to being low HP. I could have easily done that sacrifice room, but I'm happy I did because I got a knife, dude. A classical mom's knife run is a, an absolute god way to end this, in my opinion. All right, we popped our first satanic, meaning we're gonna get another devil deal on this floor. I did not expect this to be the devil run, but I am straight up having a good time. We have one three guppy, so guppy is in the cards, especially if we're running full on devils. We'll probably see another guppy item. I'll even go to the negative, uh, go dark room, maximize my odds of uh, becoming guppy here. Hopefully, treasure infamy. That's just a straight up good item. This is feeling like a rebirth run, except uh, maybe Creed Skullet. But everything else, are these not all rebirth items? Oh, excuse me. You're supposed to die. Thank you. Luck up. I'd love to find a tail, we can take that to the dark room and get 2-3 Guppy. In the meantime, we'll take this shop. Hey, arcades are good. We'll even take the pill bag, you haven't seen that many, uh... Wow, tears up, nice. I have not seen that many cards, and we've seen a lot of good, uh, pills. We also picked up a drowsy pill, which could be good for probably boss rush itself. Actually, I really want to see if I can make it. Uh, but I'm realizing Jell is good. Actually, we can go to the mausoleum and we'll have more time because it will be 25 minutes. Yeah, can you get the full card from a tinted skull if you have baggy pill? I don't, I don't know this because pill baggy removes all cards from uh, the from the run. So what happens? You know, it probably just spawns a teleport pill instead. I imagine that's what happens here. Um, this is not useful to me. I'm just gonna get rid of my heart so I get damage up. Pretty sure the Tinted Skull also does not show up on Mausoleum 2. It just physically can't. It only shows up on Depths 2. So right now, we don't have any way to teleport and get a boss rush. We just kind of have to play well and play fast. We have about five minutes for two floors. With knife, it should be easy. Ooh, I kind of want that, actually. Oh, my idiot! <laughs> Dumbass, what are you doing? I know it's only going to affect me for two floors, but the ice is so strong, but I literally have knife. I, I don't need it. I'd rather have a higher chance to see both of my items. Right. Well, I see no reason why not to just go. We could have blown up a keeper, but whatever. She's in the ground! Oh, oh no! Goodbye, Siren. You're done for. Nothing. Hey, a Judas Shadow. I think that's really worth it. I might just 
die. Let me spawn some soul hearts on the ground and die. I'd have to lose all my 9 lives, but I don't think that's a bad idea. Double damage up would be sick. Boom. Oh! Hey, and broken glasses actually worked. I guess I might as well try and get a... Oh, I was hoping for eternal heart. I kind of want that as well. Uh, I was hoping for a poison touch to complete my spun progress. Is there any way I can get rid of hearts effectively here? It doesn't look like it. I'm looking for like a sacrifice room play or something here. It's not looking likely. Infamy is goaded, by the way. Infamy is giga goaded, actually. I mean, I could just, I guess, suicide on the blood bank. That wouldn't be bad. Yeah, whatever. Here, we're doing this. And we gotta do it fast, because we only have like 30 minutes. Hurry up. I'm rich! Nice, okay, let's go. I, I, I have to hurry the hell up. Oh my lord. Uh, teardrop charm, unidentified pill. I'm no longer Kane, this can't be good. It's, it's fine. All right, we gotta go. Two minutes, oh, I didn't check the shop. I have the money, I have to. We got, oh, our birthright changed, I just noticed. And we got restocked, which is cool. Our birthright changed into uh, Judas's birthright, just because we turned into Dark Judas. So now whenever we use Satanic Bible, we kind of just get a fat damage up. Okay, Gehenna, terrifying. However, not impossible. We can do this. Secret, oh, three red chests. This is a rare secret room. Oh my! I have to, I literally have to. It's just not, it's not a case of I don't want to, I have to. That was almost conjoined as well. That would have been sick, but I can't. Okay, we're in the no-no zone right now, but I just need to clear some rooms and I can get Satanic Bible. I have a guaranteed soul heart happening here. I just need to be uh, not dead. <laughs> oh wow, yeah, that's, that's helpful. Three more rooms, I mean, three rooms, in Gehenna? Sounds terrifying. Three rooms in Gehenna with uh, four knives shot at a single time? That's not that bad. Also, we could probably just get a soul heart right here. I kind of want to buy the nightlight to get rid of the Curse of Darkness, but I'm not going to. That's okay. We'll at least make Hush, definitely. We'll take this to slow everything down. Uh, we get a nice speed up. We're almost at max. Uh, we'll full clear the floor. Don't even know what this is. Sure. Hey, a luck up pill? Honestly, I'm gonna say it. Over time, wow, okay, nice. This is gonna uh, affirm me even more. Over time, I feel like the luck uphill is like the second most satisfying pill. Before, I didn't really think it was. I was like, ah, luck, like, whatever. But over the years, like 10 years of Isaac, luck has been so much more prevalent and more important in the meta that getting a luck uphill is kind of really satisfying to me. Obviously, the number one is tears up, but. I can't really name a pill that I'd rather find than Tears Up and Luck Up. I, I mean, obviously there's pills that are better. Perk's pill is broken. But in terms of like satisfaction I get when I find them, for some reason I, I just feel like Luck Up pill is up there now. Okay, Mom is here. Mom will die probably really fast. <laughs> take the negative for Guppy Chance. Uh, now we can actually take this and complete our conjoined progress. Perfect, let's go! <laughs> Is this two Curse of Darknesses on the same floor? I, you know what? I'm not even gonna say anything. This is, at least it's not blind. But knowing my luck, I'm gonna get Curse of Darkness all on like Gehenna and then Womb, and then the moment I hit the Dark Room, it's gonna be Curse of the Blind. And the game's gonna laugh at my face. And then you guys will laugh. Another arcade. Well, I'm not Kane with a birthright, but I feel like there's no reason not to check it out, right? Always check out your arcades, dudes. I mean, it's literally a cent to get in there. It's a bargain. It could blow you up for a better deal chance. Look at that. One cent, and I got a 10% increase in my deal chance. So worth. Looks like we actually chose the right direction, which is sick. It was also very important because I uh, had a very real possibility of not getting to fight Hush here. I'm actually going to save my Satanic Bible because I know uh, it gives me a fat damage up. I'm not too worried about my health, so I'm gonna use it on the Hush fight, just to speed things along. All right, walk here, throw the knife, die instantly. I think Incubus got the kill there. Uh, no deal, that's okay, we were lucky to even get the other one. Let's go straight down. Okay, I found a school bag, <laughs> nice. I'm broke. I thought maybe today was the day I didn't have to go around blowing up my donation machine, that is not the case. He does not get to live today. Boom. Uh, probably, I mean, it hurts, it's kind of fun. And then between these, these are literally both complete ass, but I have school bags, so this is a little better. Me, when I blow up the entire hush floor, I can't find a single crawl space. Oh my god! Hello, hey, watch this be a guppy item, I will scream. Oh! There's unironically potential here. I have school bag, oh, wow, uh, magic skin. 
Meaning, any secret room I find, I'm just gonna plop it. I'm gonna use it as much as I can, I don't care. Plan of action, Satanic Bible, plus 5 damage, that's balanced. Use Drowsy Pill, and then probably 2 shot, uh, Blue Baby Hush variant. Wow, damage. <laughs> He, he hasn't done anything. I don't know if I could like convey this because all I've done is just shoot a knife in his face But this is the only move he's done so far <laughs> How how low are you gonna stay? How long are you gonna stay on the ground, dude? He's done for- wow, that was I think the easiest fight I've ever had so much that I turned off my brain and got hit twice That was a cr he did he did he did two moves. All right. Now, my main priority is find a secret room. And this is exactly the reason why you want x-ray goggles. Hello? No, we don't need that. Because, uh, we can find it instantaneously. Here we go. Looks like I get a damage up from doing it here too. Uh, Keeper's Kin is fine. I'm just gonna take these items. I don't think I'm gonna get a roll though. I'd love an HP up. It would help. Hey, you know what? That's the best of both worlds. Cool. Should I do it again? Uh, well, I'd like to win the run, to be honest with you, but like what kind of fun it would be if I didn't, so sure. Uh, did I use it twice or something? Why did I- why did my hearts get destroyed? Holy moly, I almost died. We found sausage, which is cool. A little bit of a small damage up, just all stats up in general. And that Satan should be no problem. You know the reason he, uh, Hush was giga slowed, by the way? I realized it's because I had stopwatch plus the drowsy pill. It, that's the reason why. Anything crazy? Oh! I will be 1 HP if I do that. Give me a second to maybe get one single satanic bible play. Just to be safe. And then I'll do it. I like that when you get a bad button, it just vine booms. I really enjoy that. Least terrifying binding of Isaac room right here. Okay. Dodge for my life. Idiot. Dumbass. What are you doing? Oh, item. Oh, Lazarus' rags. Oh, hey. <laughs> that gives me the opportunity to take a uh, brimstone. Wow. Excuse me, excuse me. What, 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 what? Wait, there's like giga potential here, no? I'm, I, I, like my rigging brain is like turning. I can feel my brain turning as we speak. I just have to do things in the right order. So, what if the play here is like this? Oh! oh, I can't use that though. Damn it. Then I need to get another charge on my Satanic Bible. Hold on. Hold on. I have a plan. I think it's working. Lost contacts. Cool. I need to clear two rooms, which should be easy with this build. Oh my god. Cool. Nice. Oh, hey, listen, that works. Perfect. Uh, my little unicorn is useless. So now, let's use Satanic and switch to f uh, Magic Skin. At wow! <laughs> then we can die on this, take Brimstone. We'll respawn as Lazarus, have a Satanic Bible left over just in case. Then I'm gonna drop Satanic, take the Eternal D6, and roll it, and then maybe I get something good? I don't know. Oh, balls! Alright, I'll take balls. Alright. I I'm happy with that result, to be honest with you. If I could have gotten anything, I'm happy that it was balls. I now have sausage and balls. Uh, excuse me? You're joking. The boss was on the bottom left? I thought for sure it was this direction. I guess I do have rerolls. I could just might as well do this. Yay. <laughs> uh, it's actually impressive that nothing deleted there, so. And it looks like we finally have our boss. Hi, Lamb. I kind of wanted to stand next to him and deal damage, but it isn't doing that much. So I'm going to do it this way instead. The actual way to use Mom's Knife. Okay, well, GG! That was awesome, and shout outs to the mod boiler floor. That thing was sick. GG. We're getting close to Dead God, and right now I'm streaming. We're gonna get even closer. Join the stream, twitch.tv. Let's go!